Hello, hi friends, welcome back to my channel, Isa here. So on today's video, I have a few things that I need to tell you. The first thing is I have a few, few, is it few really? I guess a uh, few announcements uh, about like my videos for the coming week and then I have a haul. This haul is about the is about <laughs> is the stuff that I bought for myself and for my families because as you watching this I think I already be on my flights back to plan that. Um yeah I'm going back again but this time I'm going to my mom's side because you know your friends here have like few houses uh one is for my one is my dad's side, one is my mom's side. So this time around, uh, I'm going to my mom's side because of the holiday is longer. So I, I have more time to go back to Kelantan instead of to Kuala Lumpur because it's gonna be like the whole day of journey, fly back from here to KL, KL to Kelantan. It's just you know, it's it's about this is a bit of a mess um, because if you know the the maps of it. We are from Hong Kong, it's actually like pass through Kelantan, if they have like direct flight it should be good but it is what it is so yeah so before I go into the haul I'm just gonna tell you on um, like sort of announcement um, I decided to upload like every day um, of course like at night like maybe around 10 to between 9 to 10 at night every day until the day that I got back because uh, I have a lot of photos and videos that I want to share with, it, with you guys and you guys did ask me some of you did ask me about my trip to um, Europe last year and I do have a lot of footage it just took me longer to edit and most of it gonna be full with photos and my voiceover because I don't really um, vlog while I'm there I'm not sure how many videos it's gonna be because I'm still editing it hopefully I can get it up before I fly back uh, on Wednesday night so that's gonna be like every single day but uh, first thing first for tomorrow night um, it's gonna be my get ready with me and me ranting about my life I guess <laughs> because uh, I have to say, like, you know, people's life, like people's life, as a human, you have like uh, your like, up and downs. And that video was when I'm a bit down and I have a lot of like complaints about life, I guess. Um, so, but now I'm in a better place, better mindset, better mood. But I think I still want to share it just for the sake of like, if you think that you are struggling with your life for whatever you are at the moment, like, um, just so you know that I'm struggled too, just because I put up like good face, uh, upload like nice photo here and there, doesn't mean that I'm happy all the time. Um, yeah, it's gonna be that. And that's gonna be on the 31st of um, January. And then for the 1st February until I think, I'll try to put it up until 9th of February, it's gonna be um, a traveling videos. And after that, I still have like few more videos like from DGI especially because the DGI I bought it after I got back so all the footage from the trip is just gonna be from my camera this one and from my phones the broken phone so you know um, yeah and I have like few more videos that I need to edit like from my trip here and there here around Hong Kong and when I went back to KL last time I do have footage from the DJI, it's just taking me forever to edit it. Editing is just taking me forever because I'm not that, how to say, I'm not that artsy. So I don't know what I wanted, even though I know how you want, you know, I, I know how the finish look to be, but I don't know how to get there, you know. That, that's just my everyday dilemma, even in real life. Like, if I'm driving, I know where's the places, but I don't know how to get there. Yeah, that's just that's just how is it all right so that's that so I guess it's gonna be it uh, every so uh, the video will be up every night um, from tonight until next Saturday um, so I hope you'll come back and watch it I guess and let me know if you have any questions I might not share everything because you know it's in the video maybe I'll do like um, summary after I got back from the trip 
to Clementine when I go back here. I'll do like a summary and talk through like where I, where did I go, where did I go, where did I went, how much is it, and where did I stay, you know, yada yada yada. So yeah, so hope you enjoy that and let's get started into the haul. Alright, so this haul is the thing that I bought for my family because I know I'm going back to Kelantan instead of just staying in KL and then this time because it's a Chinese New Year um, some of my aunts and my cousins did come back for the holiday so because if you know we are Kelantanese we always come home even though we are not celebrating the celebration <laughs> <laughs> you know, even though it is like, even though it is like Chinese New Year or the Pavali, we always join the flight, full up the flight to come home, come back home. So it's full. The flight is full. I'm just, uh, I'm not looking forward to it. But you know what? It, it, it needs to be done uh, because I don't know when I'm coming back again for this year. Maybe I'll come back during the raya like the Eid, the Eid Fitri, but that's not a promise I, s I have like few things that I need to save on and I have few other trips that I want to go so we will see but let's get into the haul alright so I'm just gonna go on the random order I just I don't know everything is all over the place so let's get started with the books um, this is what the thing that I did film like a vlog style um, follow me around is I try to find this shop um, as you guys know or don't know I like to read but I hate to read it on my iPad or no I don't have iPad anymore I hate it to read it on my phone even though I have a lot of like PDF style um, so I don't like and then I don't like to, to listen to it for some reason when I listen to the book I'm just my my mind is just wandering around so I don't like it so I don't really like to listen to it so I prefer to have this kind of book like a actual book but the book is quite expensive when you want to buy a lot and then you know sometimes you just read it once and then you don't want to read it anymore so I decided to hunt at the secondhand bookstore here in Hong Kong um, I know they have three or four bookstore here in Hong Kong the nearest one is in the Xiong one uh, so if you're interested, you know, if you are stay in Hong Kong, you're interested in the Shio one. Um, the, the, the store called Flow Bookstore. Um, they have a lot of books there. Yeah, you're gonna see the vlog, I guess, after I got back and tried to edit it. So there's a two books that I bought. Um, this, the first thing is a Safe Heaven by Nicholas Park. I really want to buy this book for a while, but you know it's quite expensive but this one is cost me around 17 ringgit for 35 dollars so it's quite cool so yeah so it's gonna this is gonna be the first book I guess I'm gonna bring this with me to fly back home to read it while I'm on flights and then the second book is this um, daughter by Jean Shimil looks like this the main reason why I bought this because it looks really that's it because why not <laughs> because I don't know the author so it looks pretty and it's quite cheap it's only like three dollars which is like less than 15 ringgit or around 15 ringgit so together I got it around like less than 30 so it's quite a good it's quite a good price so these two is the first thing that I bought okay so what else um the next one is from Sasa I bought this face Makeup removal and cleansing pad. This is kind of like, uh, is it like reusable, eco friendly? Hmm. This is like a sponge, but it's not a sponge, it's more like a. I don't know how to tell it, but it's kind of like a carpet. <laughs> you know, carpet type of material. It's like a soft carpet. So you have like two sided of it, and then the way that you use it, you can just like uh, damp it put your cleanser on here and then just like wash your face directly and it did work wonders actually it did take up my makeup quite good so I'm impressed the thing is like because it is white it's uh, how to say it becomes not white anymore <laughs> but people say you can just throw it in the wash and then 
it becomes white again. The thing is, I don't have washer, like you know, washer and dryer in my house. Usually, I just put it. Usually, I just send it to Dobby downstairs. So yeah, I just wash it by hands, but it's not really white anymore. But you know, whatever. So if you go to Sasa, you might want to try this. It's a bit expensive actually. Um, it's more than it's around like 50 ringgit to 25 ringgit ish. I'm talking about ringgit because it's 88 dollars for two. So, but I guess it's good. It's good. It's kind of like exfoliating your face at the same time, but it's not really harsh. It's really soft because of the carpet ish material. <laughs> All right. So the next one that I bought is some perfumes because some of them want perfumes and. Why not? I want to buy mine as well. So let's show mine. So this is mine. This is what I bought for myself. This is the Narciso Rodriguez. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how to say the names. But this is the box. So I, when I went to Europe last time, last year, I did shop in Sephora and I got the sample of this one. And I did wear it and I love it because it smells musky-ish. I don't know. I'm, this is a bottle. How pretty it is. The aesthetic of it is so... Um, uh, there's another box in black. If you bought like a bigger size, this is like 50. The 100 is in black and this one is in... I think it's the same but I don't know. But yeah, it smells so good. I like this kind of smell like a musky. The only thing that I can say is musky, <laughs> you know, because I don't like sweet, I don't like like a soft smell. It's just eh, I don't like that kind of smell. So this one is good, and it's kind of like linger around all day. So when I went, when I went, when I got that uh, as a sample last time when I went in Milan, um, I wear it throughout the rest of the trip from Milan, and it keeps on linger throughout the day so each time when I wear that perfume it reminds me of the Euro trip so you know I can feel like I'm on a vacation even though I'm at home at the moment so that's that all right so the next one that I bought is a number five Chanel my aunt won this one so I just bought it for her um, no I'm not paying <laughs> she's gonna pay me back I'm not that rich guys but yeah she bought this one I've been looking for this Chanel um, perfume for a while looking as if like I want to buy it but it's quite expensive this is like 800 for 50 that one is around 600 it's actually not that <laughs> it's actually quite expensive so this one is quite expensive that one is around 600 ish dollar this one is like around 900 dollar for 50 millimeter so that's that and then for my uncle I bought this Cristiano Ronaldo 100 millimeter for 400 so this one is quite cheap this is quite nice um, I like the smell of it I think this is how my uncle smelled at least the way that I remember it <laughs> so I hope he gonna like it um, Cristi Cristiano Ronaldo is just like the gimmick of it but I kind of like the smell all right so next is from Zara um, yeah this is from the kids for the kids for the kids because um, kids as if like my cousins because my cousins is small kids um, I'm the first grandchild in the family for my mom's side so you know and my mom's is the first child in the family so yeah that's what I'm I grew up like taking care of my 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 siblings so yeah so we have a few things here so I have a few things the first one I have is a shirt for me this is only this cost me only like what $40, 20 ringgit. I kind of like the color of it, you know, I like brown and orange, so I have this one, this very soft, I like it, so why not, just wear it around the house, and then I bought this for my aunt, this one, because she wants this kind of style, focus, <sighs> alright, she kind of like into 
this style at the moment, like the black at the neck and hands. I don't know. So she wants that. I bought that. That's what she wants. That's what I bought her. All right. And for the kids, we have five kids at home. Um, my youngest auntie has three, and my third auntie has two kids. Um, three boys, two girls. So. They want something similar for five of them, which is like not easy, but I found this at Zara and it costs $50, which is like quite good. And it's this shirt. <laughs> this shirt. New follower. So I guess they can follow me on Instagram now. <laughs> so new follower. So I have five size. Is a if you know kid size, then the one that I have is 110, 140, 150, 132, and 124, I guess. So that's the size of the kids. So I have five shirts of that for the kids. That's crazy. And then that's for my. Oopsie. That's for my auntie. And no, that's for my siblings. Alright, so that's for my cousins, and then uh, I have one more stuff, two more for me, <laughs> and then there's another four things that I bought, like it's considered two things because it's similar, so I bought these two perfumes from Zara, and it's like $50 each, um, these two smell quite good for a guy, I hope they like it. Um, one for my uncle and one this is like my auntie's husband so it's gonna be this so I have these two and then I have t-shirt because they want a t-shirt this one is for my brother just a black t-shirt like because Zara don't have any t-shirt at the moment but I like this kind of t-shirt the material of it is so soft so it's just a plain black t-shirt nothing nothing fancy but you know I like the the material of it, so that's why I bought that. So I hope they like it. But if they don't like it, I don't mind. I can wear it. Um, what else? It's almost nine, guys. It's almost nine, and I need to finish get ready and go to work. So, yeah, I still have another few things that I need to buy for my grandma. I think for my grandma, I'm just gonna buy like the hand lotion. And that's for my grandma, for my mom's, and my auntie. That's another auntie at home. And that's gonna be that. Who else? I guess that's that. So I'm gonna see everyone's at home. Um, yeah, I'm not sure. I need to come back. I need to go back now because I'm not sure if I'm going back during the eat. If someone's coming with me, if <laughs> then I might go home. If not, I might just stay here. My mom said if I didn't go home, she wants to come with my brother. So if that the case, I'm good. Whatever. Uh, we'll see how is it. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to come back and watch the next next video for the rest of the week until the 9th of February. So I hope you enjoy this and let me know if you want anything. <laughs> because if I go back or if my friend go back, if you want anything, I can just like give it to them and they can give it to you so i hope you enjoyed this video um don't forget to follow me on twitter instagram and like this video if you like it and i'll see you in the next video guys thank you for watching bye